platform is sandy size in width. The eyes of the world are once again riveted on the central Philippines as Super Typhoon Haiyan, locally known as Yolanda, made landfall in the early morning hours of Friday, November 8th. Being called the fourth most powerful storm ever recorded and believed to be the strongest to ever make landfall, this storm, packing maximum winds of more than 230 miles per hour, caused an unprecedented level of destruction. Philippine field office personnel have been in continual meetings with district leadership as well as the arriving Samaritan's Purse team. Nazarene disaster response assessment teams have traveled by ferry, foot, and motorcycle to reach the hardest hit areas, with team reports becoming available late Sunday night. Initial reports are that while power and communication infrastructures are destroyed and some cities have been described as level, there has been no reported loss of life among the some 2,000 Nazarenes living in these hardest hit areas. The Philippine Field Office, in coordination with local district leadership and Nazarene Compassionate Ministries, is already launching the first of the relief efforts. The Eastern Visayas and Panay districts were the hardest hit and are the focus of the initial response. Supplies have been purchased and emergency food kits are at this moment being prepared by local Nazarene volunteers for distribution to Urmak, where the Nazarene churches have been leveled. Supplies are also being prepared for distribution in Samar. In Tacloban, the Church of the Nazarene was one of the few structures left standing and has become a temporary morgue. Once security in the area is assured, relief supplies will be flown in and the church will become our primary staging area. Your prayers are desperately needed in the days ahead. With the incredible loss of life and damaged infrastructures, disease is always a major concern. Pray for those Nazarene brothers and sisters who have been through this unprecedented disaster. Pray for those who are responding. Pray for the local leadership as they seek the best and wisest response strategy. Your partnership financially is also greatly needed. The emergency kits with food for a family of five for three days cost approximately 12 U.S. dollars each. We have already launched preparations for 2,000 of these kits. There are many additional expenses involved for shipping, distribution, security, and communications. You can partner in this very tangible way by visiting the Nazarene Compassionate Ministries website and by clicking on the Give Now button. Emails have been coming in literally from around the world with words of encouragement and assurances of prayers and partnership. Thank you so very much. As a global church of the Nazarene, we are standing in the gap for our brothers and sisters in the Philippines. This is Todd Abisher reporting for WMC News, Manila.